team from Leisure Travel Vans. We're in beautiful downtown Winnipeg, Manitoba. Of course, home of the Winnipeg Jets. You don't always have to be at lakes and oceans and up camping in forests. If you're looking for a small motorhome, the 2020 Serenity is the one. Great for urban RVing in the city. You can take it out to the lakes. You can take it out to the forest campgrounds, anywhere you want to go. It's small. It's 24 feet, 6 inches long, 8 feet, 2 inches wide, and 10 feet, 3 inches in exterior height. Has a stand-up three-piece dry bathroom. It sleeps up to four people. It has four seat belts. Great exterior storage, great interior storage. I can't wait to show you. Let's go have a look inside the motorhome. You're going to love the interior of the 2020 Serenity. As George from Seinfeld would say, serenity now. This is one beautiful motorhome. Curved, solid wood doors. This one is done in maple. We do solid maple. We also have the wood color of cherry. If you order the Espresso, it is stained cherry wood. As you can see, the driver and passenger seats turn and swivel. And I love the new leg extension on the Mercedes seats. It's absolutely beautiful. All done in ultra leather. This is the fog. We've added a little texture to it, so it's not as slippery. We have fog, earth, and mountains. So we have three different leather colors, three different wood colors, and two different glamour packages, including the brand new shadow gray, or you can also go with the white glamour package as well. So this is a great little area for entertaining, sitting back, relaxing. My TV at the back will swivel and face me from the back area. I can also have up to four people with seat belts. This model will also sleep for. This will make it into a super single bed, or I can expand it out into a double bed. Plus we have a lagoon table. Lock the first leg in. In. We'll snap the second leg in and it just locks in place like this and then I can just mount the table just like this and I can lock it in place or I can leave it unlocked if I wanted to spin the table around but you can see I can adjust it from different heights dinner for four I can also use it as a computer desk plus the table can move to the back when you order the optional sofa and I've got a work desk in the back area plus you're gonna love this part of the design you can slide it over into the galley area and use it as a counter extension I've moved it to the back and now I've got a work area or I can use it for dinner when I'm watching my TV in the back area. So it's a great multifunctional table. I can use it as a work desk. I can use it for his dinner and I can check all my emails that I haven't got back to yet. Now you can also sleep for people. So two sleep in the back or we can make this into a super single bed or into a double bed. Let me show you how simple that is. Okay, so then we bring our main base support table down and we put our last cushion in place and we've got ourselves a nice big 48 inch wide by 80 inch long bed. How great is this? Nice big double bed. Once again, that's the great thing about the Serenity. 24 feet, six inches long, sleeps four, drives four with seat belts. So now we're back into a living area from a bed just to kick back and relax. You've got lots of room to enjoy the motorhome. Plus my TV turns and symbols. I can watch TV from all the way up here in the driver passenger seat. So I love how we've integrated the cab area on the Mercedes Benz chassis to part of the motorhome. As you can see, it's easy access in and out of the motorhome. We've redesigned the upper cabinets. As you can see here, we have our optional safe, two big storage areas up front and look how beautiful this new shadow gray glamour package is the curved doors european hidden hinges i love how they lock in place just simply touch the button and they pop open of course we have led lights up front more storage area over on this side nice solid wood if you put your fingers in here you can see how we pre-drill the cabinets screw them together that way when you're bouncing down the road the wood will never crack over on the other side storage space storage space storage space look at this lots of storage space. I love the curved doors, European hidden hinges. Nice and easy to open with the handles here. Lots of storage space. We're going to get that in a second, but look at this beautiful roof. This is all vacuum bonded, fully insulated, ducted air conditioning throughout the entire motorhome, which is really important on a hot day. I have cold air in the front and cold air in the back. Of course, LED lights throughout. I love our beautiful skylight, beautiful sunny day here in Manitoba, but I love the fact that we can have screen or on a hot day like this we can have fresh air and keep the sun off of our heads so here's our battery disconnect switch we also have our 16,000 btu furnace a little more storage area underneath here and underneath on this side we've got our breaker box with our fuses and our breakers and underneath here we have access to our optional surge protector and our water pump and our water pump's got a quick pick up so if you want to pick up RV antifreeze to winterize the unit or you can pick up fresh water and put it into your fresh water tank that's all located on this side we have a place here for your coats all done in ultra leather and our switches here for our LED lights you can dim them right here this red light see how it's on when we're over in our service area that means that I've turned on my service area light 
We also have our LED lights built into the cabinets. They look beautiful. And our camping mode, non-camping mode for our step-in. We have our outside light and our inside light switch. When you turn on your interior light switch, you can also have a light down in the bottom of the step well. Let's look up here. We've got a beautiful, fantastic fan with rain sensor. That's standard. So you can set it by temperature. If it starts to rain, we'll automatically close. We talked a little bit about the ducted air conditioning. 15,000 B2 air conditioner with a heat pump. So if you're plugged into campground service that you're paying for, you can actually heat the coach as well as cool the coach off the same air conditioner. Up above, we've got lots of storage space. With a small motorhome, you really cannot have enough storage space. Look how much storage we have upper cabinets. We double shelf them so that you can put your plates here, cups up here. That's a smart little move to have there. As we work our way, let's have a look at this beautiful picture window. The valences are all done in ultra leather that color match the ultra leather color that you pick. So we have fog, mountain, and earth. And I like this. We have our daytime shades and we have our nighttime shades. And we mentioned earlier, awning style window. See this? We can have the window open. It can be pouring rain outside. I don't have to worry about the rain coming into the motorhome and I get some nice cross ventilation. As you work away in the galley here, we're all done in solid Corian countertops. We have two different colors of countertops. This is the Antarctica white. We also have a new color called stone. Nice little garbage can here. A lot of people use that just to fill it full of ice and use it as an ice cooler. So deep stainless steel sink right here. Chrome faucet. We also have a sink cover that goes over the sink. Very nice. That just slides back into this area here. Two burner spark ignition stove. We've also got our stainless steel backsplash. Accessory channel that's built right in. You can put your different accessories onto the channel. We've also got LED lights underneath here. And you'll notice that we have an inverted plug as well off of our new 2000 watt inverter. So you can plug in a small coffee maker without having to have your generator on. You need storage. We always talk about storage. Look at this beautiful reverse curve doors. All done in maple. Look at this here. Pot and pan pull out drawer. Really smart. We also do cherry and espresso. I love this. The reverse curve. It's one thing to have a curved door. Look at this beautiful reverse curved door. Lots of storage space underneath here. And drawers. Look at this. Nice big pull out drawers. Solid wood drawers lined. Very nice. Full water filtration on all the Serenity models. And I like this, we have a great place here for all your silverware. New for 2020 Serenity, we have a brand new Dometic thermostat control system here for your air conditioner, your furnace, your fans. This new thermostat is totally designed to work with the optional propane generator, which has auto gen start. So for example, animals or pets in the uh, motorhome, I set the temperature, it will automatically turn on the generator when it gets too hot in the motorhome and cool it off. Or if your batteries get too low, you can set it for voltage, it will automatically come on and recharge the batteries. So you don't have to worry about batteries getting low. On the other side of the galley, you've got a beautiful hanging closet down below here i like this little place for your shoes when you come into the motorhome so you don't step on them in the step well so here i have my convection microwave so it's your standard microwave it can also be an oven the nice thing for 2020 is that we've inverted the microwave off of the brand new 2000 watt pure sine wave inverter. If I wanted to warm something up in the microwave, I can turn on the inverter, turn on the microwave. I don't have to turn on the generator. So nice new feature on all Serenities for 2020. Now this is the big one, the brand new Dometic three-way, so propane, 12 volt power and 110 power. We have three different sources to run the fridge. And what's great about this brand new fridge, separate freezer, separate fridge, and what's great about a Serenity is I can access it from either side. So it swings, the door swings either way. So if I'm in the back living room area and I want to get a drink out of the fridge, not a problem. If I'm in the front living area and I want to get something out of the fridge, not a problem. So I love the brand new Dometic three-way, two-door swing fridge. And what serenity wouldn't be complete without a beautiful pull-out pantry. I've been fasting for four days now. I know it's hard to believe. I've given up on Jenny Craig. I'm just not going to eat, but my pantry is bare. Hidden storage area down below. Nice little place for things you don't have to access all the time. Some more storage area. Look at this pull-out drawers. Solid full-out drawer extension. Solid wood lined. But nice big drawers for storage. Oh, I love that sound. Plus a hanging closet right here. So we have our inside service center right here. So we've got our optional equalizer, stabilizer jack. So it doesn't move around, no yaw effect. 
We also have our Truma AquaGo Comfort Plus hot water heater control. You can turn it to Eco, which will not heat the one liter of hot water. Put it on Comfort, it will heat the one liter of hot water. Sea level tank monitor system right here so we can check our batteries. Fresh water tank is empty, gray is empty, black is empty, and the propane is 27% full. Also can turn on our water pump right there. Our solar panel controller is right here. Either an optional 200 watt or 300 watt solar panels. Great little option to have. This motorhome is equipped with the optional 3.6 kilowatt propane generator and it has the auto start system so it will automatically come on if you set the temperature or if you set it for batteries it will come on standard feature when you order the optional propane generator and last but not least our standard brand new standard for 2020 the 2000 watt pure sine wave inverter i really love this feature so our tv turns and swivels it faces front or back brand new sound bar but i'm you're gonna love this area so most small motorhomes maybe have one living room area this motorhome has two living areas one in the front one in the back, all in 24 feet, six inches. I like this little feature, nice little privacy curtain that separates the living area from the bedroom area or the second living area, because you can use either one, because we have a bed up front and we have a bed in the back. Optional sofa bed. So standard is a full-time bed. This would be the option, gives you a nice big full-size bed. The optional sofa bed is very nice because it gives you two living areas. And look at the size of this bed, but look how much room you have. What a beautiful bed. It's all done in memory foam. It's super comfortable there's a few little seams in here but it you don't really feel them when you're laying down it's quite spectacular okay then you can move the bed back in to a second living area sofa area and look how beautiful this is got our beautiful awning style windows privacy shades daytime night shades all done in ultra leather once again that matches got our beautiful tv new for 2020 is the sound bar with a smart blu-ray player you can see their led lights i've got built-in reading lights i've got usb plugs here i've got inverted plugs off the new 2000 watt pure sine wave inverter i can run a sleep acme machine got a shelf here for charging once again look way up there you got the led lights and you've got the air conditioning ducts and storage space is always important look at the storage that you have Lots of storage here and big storage up here. So tons of storage space. Okay, above the TV area, we got our electronics area. So this is where we have our smart Blu-ray player, which is standard for 2020 Serenity models. USB plug chargers here. This is our WineGuard 2.0 Wi-Fi booster with 4G TV antenna. The little green button here I turn on. So now I've got it on TV antenna boost. Turn on this one on this side. Now I've got it on Wi-Fi boost. You can also have 4G capability. You can buy the service from WineGuard or you can get a second SIM card from your mobile supplier and then you can plug that sim card into the 2.0 on the roof and then normal data charges would apply you now with some other connections here for plugs and hdmi plug for your playstation 4 not that i have one but if i did i'd be playing madden football we also have a great option for the wine guard satellite dish the wine guard t4 which does dish direct and bell and we're also pre-wired in case you don't want to go with that satellite system inverted plug as well and i like the area that you can work back here you also have the table that you can put on use it to work on you can use it for food so we also have the little ottoman that comes up if you just want to have the ottoman look how much space we have how much room we have feels huge for a small motorhome this is going to sound really crazy but i'm going to invite you into the bathroom most people don't ever talk about the bathroom but look at this beautiful curved door nice big three-piece private bathroom with a stand-up shower it's like i'm well over six foot one look at this i'm standing up in the shower privacy shower door lots of room handle for getting in and out integrated the shower head soap dispensers you can put everything right here and this is a nice big bathroom area china toilet down below here nice little area here for putting supplies solid surface countertop stainless steel sink place here for your towels medicine cabinet water pump at night if you forget to turn on your water pump if you're dry camping you can turn on your water pump right there we have a gfi connected plug here so if you ever lose power in the motorhome always check this plug nice dressing mirror here plus don't forget you can get leisure clothing mugs and stuff it's absolutely fantastic but this is a real bathroom 
Let's have a look at the next generation of Mercedes-Benz chassis. I think you're going to love it. Look at this 10.25 inch monitor. It's got smart intelligence. You can swipe it. No longer do you push buttons anymore. You swipe. Or you can just talk to it. Hey, Mercedes. How can I help you? You also have XM radio, Bluetooth. It has Apple CarPlay. It has Android Auto. Also, I like how they've redesigned the map lights for the old school boys that actually have maps. I'm not sure why you would because you've got voice activated navigation system. This is kind of cool place here for your sunglasses. And look at this smart wheel, multifunctional steering wheel. All the controls are right here. I never have to take my eyes off the road. It'll tell you your miles per gallon when you're driving down the road, what your RPM level is. Uh, if you're doing good or not with the speed, it actually gives you rewards. We've got new airbags in the seats, airbags up here, airbag steering wheel, airbag here, seven speed transmission. It has the V6 turbo engine with 188 horsepower, 325 foot pounds of torque, fun to drive. And I think the best part about it, it has electronic steering. I've never driven a vehicle with electronic steering it is a dream you can turn the steering wheel with your baby finger and i like the new transmission you just press park or knock it up or knock it down for drive and reverse so we also have some great storage areas up front three separate consoles in this area here we've got charging systems for your phone you can wirelessly charge supported smartphones right here you also have usb-c connections here we also offer two years of roadside assistance on all leisure travel vans that are bought from the dealer which includes concierge service towing service, uh, lockout service. If you run out of fuel, they'll come and give some fuel to get to a gas station, tire repair. So lots of great features to have for the first two years roadside assistance. Plus when you own a leisure travel van, you get to join my LTV. Absolutely fantastic service. We have walkthrough videos on service. We have all of our warranties and our manuals. You can join contests such as our photo contest. You can also join travel clubs. We have leisure travel van rewards. Wow, what a beautiful motorhome. The sleeping areas for up to four people seat belts for four but if you think this is great wait till you see the outside it's absolutely stunning the brand new 2020 Serenity built on the next generation of Mercedes-Benz chassis. Totally redesigned. You can see all the redesign of the lights and the grill. They've actually increased the step area here. I think they did it just for me because of my big feet. I can actually put two feet in here to clean the window and this window does need some cleaning. But you're absolutely going to love it. Three liter uh, V6 turbo diesel engine, 188 horsepower, 325 foot-pounds of torque. But the big change on the new chassis is a seven-speed automatic transmission. So you're going to get better fuel economy when you're going down the road. So in the next generation of Mercedes-Benz, they've added some great safety features that we buy from Mercedes-Benz on the Serenity model. So we have front collision impact assist active. We have lane keeping assist active. We've also got high beam assist. It also has traffic sign assist. It also has a great new feature called active distronic cruise control. So when you set your cruise control and you're driving down the road, if the car in front of you is slower, it'll back you off from the vehicle. Mercedes-Benz has also added more airbags into the motorhome. Both front windshield pillars and in the seats have extra airbags for more safety when you're driving down the road. Some other really cool features, of course, we have heated mirrors, power mirrors. I love this feature. You can actually knock the mirrors in. If you're in a tight area, you have a tree or something you need to get around, bring the mirrors in, but always make sure you bring the mirrors back out when you're driving down the road. I like this little courtesy light for getting in and out of the motorhome. The swivel seat mechanism is at the front now, so look how easy it is to turn your seats. Simple. Fully curved wall. This is all fiberglass. This is built like a boat or a Corvette car. All molded fiberglass fronts and sides. Vacuum bonded steel frame floor. Vacuum bonded aluminum frame roof with ducted air conditioning. And let's talk about this beautiful paint. Each color is painted three times and two coats of clear. And you have three choices of exterior paint. We have champagne, Eurosport, and silver, all beautiful. A couple of things I absolutely love on the Serenity. Look at this beautiful molded curved fiberglass door. It's got the built-in screen. And I really like this feature. You can lock the door in place, lock solid, and you can have the screen closed. So you get lots of fresh air, the hidden screen, lots of fresh air going into the motor room. Now that is a smart design. I really like this. This is a power step. When you open the door, it automatically comes out. We have a button right here. You can turn that off and now it's in camping mode. So when I close the door, the step's not going in and out all the time. It's going to save the motor life. Don't panic if you happen to forget 
to have the step on non-camping mode, when you start the ignition, it automatically goes back up. Another great feature on the Serenity is the handle for getting in and out of the motorhome. We also have it lit, and we have a three-way switch on the light, so you can go outside, outside handle, and inside handle. You're gonna love this beautiful box awning. First of all, built-in LED lights, and it's got wind sensor on it, so you just simply turn on the awning, press the button, it automatically comes out. So it's gonna come out about seven feet, and it's just over 12 feet in length. And it's wind sensor, which means if you have some gusts of wind, you forget to bring the awning in, it will automatically retract. Great safety feature when you're RVing. Okay, you can see it's a little bit breezy today, so always make sure you leave the awning on, because if you turn the awning off, you disable the wind sensor part. So we're just gonna simulate a little more gust of wind. And you can see it automatically retracts. That is a great safety feature. As we work our way down, we've got a beautiful 16,000 BTU furnace. So storage is very important in a small motor room and we have lots of exterior storage. You can see our first compartment, nice big storage area here, all done in galvanized sheet metal. It's all carpeted, so easy to clean. I love how it locks in place. Underneath here, we spray foam all the compartments underneath so it's quieter when you're going down the road. It also prevents any road damage. Over here, we've got a 110 electrical plug and we've got our ventilation for our refrigerator make sure that you don't block the refrigerator ventilation we have our optional alcoa aluminum rims we go with six rims so inner outer both sides and the two front ones on the outside rims we go with the durabright finish which makes it nice and shiny the great thing about the aluminum rim option is that you have built-in valve extensions and the other great thing about aluminum rim is they dispense heat from your brakes so you're gonna have longer life of your brake usage as we work our way down we have more exterior storage nice big exterior storage bin here once again Again, all handcrafted aluminum doors. I love how the door drops down, easy access into the motorhome. We've got our built-in barbecue quick connect. So you can run a barbecue right off the main propane tank. We also have another storage bin right above the floor line here. This one has the optional electric sofa bed. So if you go with the full-time bed, you have actually pick up a little more storage underneath here, but great little storage area here. And if we have a look up here, we've got our beautiful frameless glass windows. I always call them the sexy frameless glass windows. Awning style, which means that they open out so that if it's raining outside, you can still have ventilation. You don't have to worry about rain getting into the motorhome. So beautiful curved glass window contoured into the fiberglass body. And by the way, this body is fully insulated as well. The roof, the walls, and the floor. And full fiberglass rear mat, separate fiberglass bumper. We have our 5,000 pound receiver hitch, seven pin connector plug so you can tow up to 5,000 pounds. Has a GCWR of 15,250 pounds minus your wet weight. We've got our egress window, our fire escape window, built-in backup camera, LED lights. And this is probably my favorite part because I like to golf, but if you like to fish or you need to carry stuff, look at this, nice big storage area underneath here. So lots of exterior storage, which is really important in a small motorhome. Full water filtration, that's very important to have. Look how beautiful this wall is. Look how beautifully curved it is, all the design in it. So here's our service center. This is where we control the outside of the motorhome. We can fill it up with water. Let's start off with the optional macerator pump. So what this does is you can actually pump uphill if you want to. It's easy to dump. You can dump in a smaller station if you don't have a three inch dump at home. Even if you order the macerator pump, we always include the three inch dump hose. You could always manually dump. And we've got a black water flush in here as well. And gray water flush valves are right here. Remember, always dump your black first and then your gray. Over here, we've got our connections for cable and exterior satellite. So if you have a portable satellite dish, you can hook up right here. We have a great optional satellite dish. This motorhome has it. It's the WineGuard T4 satellite dish. It does dish direct and bell. And very important, we're also pre-wired for a satellite dish on the roof as well. Is there work our way across? We've got an LED light right here for your service center at nighttime, which is a great little feature to have. You can turn that off and on inside the motorhome. Propane fill is right here, so we have a 15 gallon propane tank with the barbecue quick connect on the outside, which is very nice. Over here, we've got our water switch for turning on our water pump. So if you forget to turn on the water inside the motorhome and you want to have an exterior shower, you can turn on the water pump here and you have hot and cold exterior shower right here. This is where our water fill is, so we run our water hose up through here and we connect it up into here and we can fill up our 
24 gallon water tank or we have pressure water as well. Everything is all in one spot. Let's have a look at this. We've got our batteries right here. So new for 2020 model year, we have two deep cycle AGM six volt batteries. So maintenance free batteries, that's new for 2020 on all Serenity models. We have our optional generator. So you can have a 3.6 optional propane generator or a 3.2 optional diesel generator. If you order the optional 3.6 kilowatt propane generator for 2020, we have auto gen start comes with it. It doesn't come with the diesel generator, only with the propane generator. So nice little feature to have. Also standard in all Serenity models is the AquaGo Comfort Plus hot water heater from Truma. This is the best instant hot water heater there is in the market. The great thing about this hot water heater is when you have it on Comfort Plus, it will heat this one liter of hot water. It keeps it hot. As it uses up that one liter of hot water, the heat exchangers continuously heat. You have continuous unlimited hot water. It's the Truma AquaGo Comfort Plus hot water heater standard on all Serenity and Unity models. You also have your 30 amp shore power connection. Very simple to plug in your hose. And you're gonna like this brand new for 2020. We've increased it to a 2000 watt pure sine wave inverter. So you have 2000 watt inverter that'll flip your your batteries over to 110 power and we've also inverted the microwave so you can warm something up in the microwave off the battery power now so you don't have to turn on your generator so great little feature to have plus more storage in here and here's our shore power for cord for plugging in our shore power very simple to do and we still have our locking diesel fuel. I like that so nobody can tamper with your diesel fuel. And on the next generation Mercedes-Benz Sprinter chassis, they will allow you to use some B20 biodiesel. They suggest not to fill it up all the time. In a pinch, if you have B20 biodiesel and you need diesel fuel, you can put it in the new generation Mercedes chassis. Thank you very much for watching the 2020 Serenity Motorhome. It's absolutely beautiful. Once again, built on the brand new next generation of Mercedes-Benz chassis, it's absolutely fantastic. Fabulous. Just over 24 feet in exterior length, 8 feet 2 wide, 10 3 exterior height, lots of interior space, lots of exterior space. Make sure you subscribe to our YouTube channel and be the first to see our videos throughout the entire year. Dean from Leisure Travel Vans, the Serenity. You can build your Serenity exactly the way you want today. You can pick your leather colors, your wood colors, all the different options. You can build your Serenity right now.